Well, let's take a break from the uh, delicious Azure Serenity to check out the Lucinda's new creation. Looking forward to this as uh, I've been bullying her relentlessly about the uh, lack of gameplay in her levels. And I suspect she might deliver on this one. Oh, look at this stuff. I'm concerned that it's real world stuff. You know me, I hate the real world. Calexico by Lucinda. Traverse the desert to your friend's wedding. Normal medium challenge. I mean, it's a very cool looking icon despite its realism. Calexico, I believe, is a mix between California and Mexico. Which to me is like mixing, you know, a, a turducken with a turkey. But that's not why you're here. Calexico. And there's Mexicali. So it is some sort of a thing. But I don't know much about it. Let's go. So, from Pilar Jimenez, 21st Saguaro Avenue, City of Surprise Springs, country of Calexico, to Uni Nigren, <laughs> that's her last name now, I guess, 14 Kumeyayi Road, City of Adrian, country of Calexico, surprise, October 27 Springs. Is that when the level came out? Maybe, or I think it came out a bit after that, All right? Celebrate our love. You are invited to the wedding of Pilar Jimenez and Nugent Ward. Are these jokes or something? Saturday, March 4th at 4 p.m. at the Giltmore Hotel in Rising Star Calexico. Please avoid wearing white as to not outshine the bride. I always outshine the bride. That's just what I do. All right, here we are in some place. And we have run and we have a yellow dress. And listening to old-fashioned DMCA. Eh? His hat was shoved back and his spurs was a jingling and as he was riding he was singing this song Won't be tired, I don't oh, get along Morning, Junebug. Some country stuff. Edible trees remind me of straight lines. Tribute to me. Tabby cider. Cider. Ciders. Yeah, I guess you would. Have you tried the new peach flavored cider? It's 10% APV, sends shivers straight to my legs. Look at this little hobbit house. So cute. So what is right? So what is this? Ah! I actually fell for How did I have it? Oh, we're just happy. Be vigilant on corners and surfaces that their detector has much to show. Oh, what is this? Interesting way to make like a secret. Is this just a pit? I swear I stood on it when I saved and then I fell. And I like this reemergence. On the way, KS platforms. KS plus platforms. Uh, Adrian Historic Pioneer Town. We have the best apples. I like apples. Green apples. To specify. That's not GC at all. Alright, so far it's a Lucinda level. Pretty and interesting. And I might say cinematic. Okay. Customs mushroom spring things. Lovely. Okay. It's looking very good. Very unusual. Crooked branch ranch. Very quaint. Harvest. a classic Swedish barn and stretched it upwards. Well, Anton. That's a lot of windows. Howdy. Anyone who believes in critical race theory is a Marxist, a moron, or both. Whatever that means. Double jump! Yay! What's up with you? 
Haven Camel Dairy. Those are three words. So far we're just running and reading signs. Looks very pretty, don't get me wrong. Welcome to the Camel Dairy. What does that mean? Oh, no politics? Sounds almost like a joke. Let's just say it was a joke. Uh, did you know camels originally North American but crossed to Eurasia on the Bering Strait? That doesn't sound right. How come one of them remained? Whoa! Look about overgrown. Look at this illusion of a blind fall, but unless you're really unlucky with how you move, you won't die. Huh. Cute save screen. And Zalusha Desert. Whoa! Oh, look at that. Not much. I'm not much about you know modern industry or whatever, but uh, it's a nice looking wind uh, turbines. Is what they're called. Right? I'm going to Bow Willow Campground. Leave no trace. Of camping, there were Boy Scouts here earlier, they were insufferable shits. Okay. For glamping, but my wife over there makes me camp. Camping is just cosplaying as being homeless, I am old. Not quiet. Okay, mandatory challenge screen to satisfy my needs. Oh! You bitch. Didn't see that. But it's right there. That's trivial. Okay, what am I looking at? Hello, dearie, welcome to the Anzalusha Library. Anzalusinda Library. Oh, it's toy green. Oh, my god. Tell him about the secret passage. It's a secret to everyone. Wow! Harara Slot Canyon. These are the stones from Headgrinder Stone Tears level, which I really like. No GC, but we got an artifact. This is a secret border crossing. Consider volunteering here sometime.
This is the government turbine, but I hacked it to power my house. say about that. Uh, this is border control, you may pass, have a nice day. Okay, are we going into Mexico or Calexico or country of Sonora below? <laughs> below is a country, right? Are these... This is just a flat surface, yeah. Okay, that's weird to see a city or a country below us, but alright. Officer Maxwell Kingsley, Border Control Officer and Detention Center. Got yourself signs in this level. It's not easy stopping illegals. They're people too, but I do what I can to keep Calexico safe. Alright, we're definitely politically um, getting involved here for some reason. I'm not sure why. Wind, huh? Looks beautiful for some reason. Pick me up there. I'm getting umbrella in here. Whoa. Indeed I am in this little hermit's hut. Okay, curious. Let's go up. Take me off this planet and to somewhere more interesting. Holy shit. What a great use of filters. I'm not sure what's happening there now. <laughs> I guess I should stop holding stuff. I have a feeling there won't be a hundred of them. See, I said this, I mentioned this. Yeah, that is very straight uh, I mentioned this in Azure Serenity that I haven't really seen filters used like this. It's always like a circle around the character when you move around. And it's kind of mech. But these sort of full screen effects. Like this, this sandstorm event. Indigenous Reservation. Okay, maybe there are hundred coins at this rate. This gives me Advina vibes for some reason, because there was also a section of Advina that was like all the coins. Right? And you can see now it's brought a lot of fortune to our tribe. I'm so wealthy, money just fills out of my pocket, I don't give a darn. Okay, so we're still on planet Earth in fortune. Americans, Silver Dollar Casino. Okay. Okay. We've got Mezcal. Who is now? Who is this? Not custom object moving sprite with no battle. They're gambling away. Hey pal, you don't look like the gambling type. If you give me, say, five points, I'll give you a special tool. You're a special tool. Welcome to the Silver Dog Casino, home of the loosest slots. I see what you did in there. Oh, look at these custom slots. That looks awesome. I blew my kid's college fund at this place. I'll stop and get therapy after today. You gotta keep going, man. You're about to hit it big. This looks great, but it's so random. Why are we in a casino? All right, take my hard-earned cash, Mr. Shady Dude. It's a USB that will crack into any slot machine here. Those fools haven't updated their machines to adopt it like this malware. I'm shaking my head. I wanna buy? Enjoy the free. Yeah, I'm not sure why he won't just use it himself. Now we're gonna go to jail. It's time to plug in. It's time to hack. <laughs> plug in my USB into the slot machine. Oh, we're hacking! Okay, now this is awesome. Now I'm a big fan. Okay, I found the access key. Now I just gotta go to the, the, the port. The gateway. This is really cool. I love single screen key and lock challenges. A little mini game stuff. This looks really nice. Dude. Oh, 
is this key order? Crazy. What is wind over there? Hard to spot. of keys and lots of GCs, but wait, I have no GC, and I don't see one? Is this speculative? here while we're ahead, you know? That was really fun. I really enjoyed that second. At least I didn't lose my wife. She already left five years ago after I cheated with another soccer mom. Hey, it worked! Okay, well, we went to the casino, we doubled our cash. Largest audio file in the world is in this hard drive. Okay. That took a long time to install. Uncompressed audio. Is that a joke? I don't get it. I do not get but okay. You need ten coins to pass this bridge. I know. I'm also just a scammer. Scammer with blocks. Over the village of Sedona, I found in 1902. Sedona sounds like something I've heard. store but look at this, this, these graphics hello and welcome to moonchild crystal works our crystals are channels of healing and transformation people use them for everything from healing humors to focusing deeply in meditation truly our mother earth's greatest gift to us really have you tried the lima bean The tourists get a taste for free. Oh boy. Super Mario Wonder now? No. Uh, okay, hello. Marriage is not a lifelong commitment. Divorce can happen at the drop of a hat. The only true commitment of love is lying in adjacent graves. That's cool and all, but who asked? What are these background tiles with the fade? That looks cool. These dinosaurs? What, is that a cyclops toast with legs? <laughs> I don't know what's happening. 
Remember how you co your co uh, remember how your co-worker said that 73% of marriages end in divorce? She was wrong. The millennial divorce rate is only 18%. It's not so fun facts. Remember when you sent a cheap registry gift to your ex-boyfriend's wedding? You signed it with the name of his estranged sister, remember? As a prank? He knew it was you. Uh, is this Lucinda venting? Don't do things like that. <laughs> I'm quite confused. But I'm intrigued by the graphics. Look at that, dude. He's about to say something awful, but hey, he looks pretty funky. Don't date your co-worker, Victor, even though he makes you feel intense emotions. Don't date your neighbor, Isaac, even though you've had a crush on him for six years. Date your cousin's friend, Curtis. He'll be there for you every single day. Life is usually boring. He can meet the moment. What does that even mean? Okay, his venting is an art form of his own. Well, then this is high art. Whoa. Is that dead toast? No, it's not toast. It's okay that you cheated on your boyfriend in college. You're not a bad person. Consider the context two weeks before you got in a bad terrifying car crash. Heck, I'm impressed you had good sex with a neck raise on. When we cheat dev, we act out, we do crazy things. Yeah, man, don't worry, no, no consequences for your actions, everything is excusable if you try hard enough. Have a good time, come to one of our full moon dances. We got a full moon right here. Maybe I should just not read when I play Lucinda. Because I feel like I would... Just if I didn't read anything and I made up my own story of what was going on, I think I would really enjoy that. It's my pet skull, his name is Russ. Russ the pet skull. I need hollow for that. Do you need to get past those creatures in the caves? I think I can help. When I was 12 I tried to burn a bush as a ritual to see my dead grandma. I saw her and she told me to never reach out again. Ever since then I've been able to see ghosts. I can slide through this ghostly floor if you like. There's a cult down there. I think they're stashing some extra holograms. So what do you say? I go for it. And now I speak. I say good luck Erica. I'll hang out at the crystal shop while you're gone. Oh, whoa! We're playing as her now! <laughs> oh! Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> and look at her fancy umbrella. Okay, we're not allowed to explore, which is understandable. Wow, we gotta switch of characters, huh? That's cool. I'm playing as an NPC, a really stylish umbrella. So I like this track, and I like this area. that first bullet accuracy man 100% thank you all is that how you had to do that I can just stop it <laughs> wow Welcome to Crystal Moon's intentional community. <laughs> An intentional community. As opposed to that one that happened by accident. Welcome to Crystal Moon's. We live under the guidance of Father Derek. I bet he's gonna have a lot to say. He's the only one with the sixth sense that attunes him to the crystal's messages. He receives the messages through the five gods, which are moons of Jupiter. One of those is Europa, right? Galileo actually first saw five moons, not four. Father Derek was the first person to discover this. The crystal told him that this moon is called Derico. Okay. Palazzo Derico. Cool looking 
superior. Look at these blocks, man. These green solid blocks. Give me a level of those. Whoa, what are you doing? Looking away? How dare you? What's with the custom sprites that don't say anything? The crystals told me you'd be a fine member in our community. Join us. Hey, this is not uni. I can send her to a culture. Hello. Where do I sign up? <laughs> Custom holo, yeah. Well, thank you, bye. Are you that girl who says she can see ghosts? I advise you to wake up. There are no ghosts, only the five gods. Indeed, the five gods. Armada, Mango, PPMD, Mewtuki, and Hbox. You don't look like a copper racist, so I'll fill you in. This is an underground railroad for Sonoran migrants. I like working this one because it's so easy to access from Sonora. Trouble is, half the migrants end up joining Father Derek's weird religion. That guy's a creep. Did you know he used to sell protein powder on TV? Never say words again, alright? What's with these fake... Ever since the first secret, that was this, you know? It's... Making me intrigued by those blocks, but oh well. Alright, got the hollow. I wonder if I miss secrets. I haven't been super vigilant, but. Oh. Anyway, this lady has eye. So the block didn't change even with I. Oh. <laughs> Thanks for trusting me, Uni. Safe travels and be glad you never had to meet Father Derek. Didn't she say that she would wait in the shop? out of the cave in six years. Once a year she talks through the door and says she likes it better in there. Based. Excuse me. I think I should probably look a bit more for secrets. Since there have proven to be some. But let's keep going. Welcome to the beautiful Sodium Sea. Is there really a place called that? Well, nice palm tree. Beach. The skulls? <laughs> uh, lovely. I'd like to tell you a story, I bet you. Uh, I just go. Holy moly, okay, cool story. So you see, it's to be beautiful. Yeah, it looks quite nice. People vacationed here and went jet skiing. <laughs> oh, yay, dead fish. That's something I really need to have seen. The sea turned acidic. Don't ask me how or why, it's all geological jargon. Tons of fish died. Okay, that doesn't sound like it was human's fault. While those fish didn't just disappear, some beaches are covered with sand, ours are covered in fish bones. <laughs> yeah, such a sad story I had to. The 
been talking about a desalination plant for a while, but does it stall? Well, ain't that a bummer? This one's really bad here, but I bought this hut for only 300 coins. Can't argue with a good price. I don't know why my friends called me Thrifty Joe in high school. But your name is Dave. <laughs> that swings it. People who want to buy a house just bought into the capitalist system. This bus has everything I need. Yeah, does it have someone who asked? Because that is what you need. Motel, huh? Oh! This is the only place we can do vert skating around. Flip. Piece of shit. Oh, it's just like one time. Mm. Not bad. Not bad. How are we doing? We got five out of seven of these artifacts, right? Why did this become like the main default artifact? I don't disagree. It feels like the main one. I just wonder why. I guess the red one is pretty main as well. Oh, for the bait. I used to live in the city and wait tables, but my arthritis got really bad. I sell meth out here, it's the only way I can feed myself. Anyway, I want to buy some meth. Is that the story to Breaking Bad? Probably pretty close to it. Nice door. It's a scary door. That's the exit for the secret. This is a quite a gap, though. Glitchy corner. Oh, it's Afro. Are we really doing that? with a glitchy corner down? I mean, I bet it has to be. Let me just compare it. No, I guess you do have to do a glitchy corner jump. And a good one at that. No, that's not a good one. I gotta hold S more and be more ready for Umbrella. <laughs> Spaghetti. Oof. Madness jump. This level evolved from the single screen I made for the Andoy. <laughs> hey, that's me. Okay, I'm scared to press down. This level evolved from this single screen. What, the one below? The jump or this one? Don, I promise that here I'm portraying the weirdest parts of California. And by contrast, Lake Tahoe and San Francisco are uniformly beautiful. And give me to visit. <laughs> well, maybe you should make a level about the beautiful things. And not the terrifying things you're talking about here. Alright. I don't think I got anything for that secret, except for a shout out. But if you aren't me and you do that, that's gotta be pretty disappointing. Peace be with you. Finally someone I agree with. The Lord's Mountain. A 
come to this place every time I need to feel refreshed and restored. I've been here five times now. <laughs> I've never left. What is going on? This is uh, clown vomit. <laughs> nice waterfall though. Oh, what is what? What is solid? It's colored gravestone. This here is the grave of Leon Bishop. He built this mountain by hand for 20 years. Wait, is this the thing that's in uh, GTA 5 as well? In the desert, that weird colorful thing that has a alien collectible on it? That girl there took a Bulgarian research chemical. <laughs> now she's fine. Bulgarian. Why am I shining green right here? Want me to go up? So, the aliens visited this spot in 1986. I think it is that place from GTA 5. Well, I guess it's not from GTA 5. How did you not think of doing a lychee corn jump? I mean, it's not really the first thing you think of, is it? Sound effect sync with CO animation in this level? I have not noticed. Well, the, I know it's you, but it only works on the dogs. Oh. Why does he have a cape? Alright. Power lines? Oh no, that's so evil. Man, I'm exhausted, I need some food. You wanna go in the scary house? No? Perhaps not. <laughs> so let me go this way. Okay. Welcome to Within and Without Burgers. Press down to order a double double combo meal. Do we need a double double combo meal? Sounds a bit much. <laughs> Is this like the ordering pedestal? I would like to order. Hear me. Thanks for dining with us. Jesus is awesome. Point of this was. Oh. Chewing sound effects, I guess. Okay, cool. <laughs> Low country of Sonora. Yeah, we don't want to go down there. Yucky. Welcome to the beautiful city of El Centro, founded in 1906. Any Americans in chat can tell me if these are real things. I collect unemployment here in Calexico and then cross the border to work in Sonora. Wait, you can do stuff like that? Everything went out of booziness. Oh no. Or wait, that's good because we hate capitalism, right? This is City Hall. It looks like the only nice building around here, but it's shit on the inside. The toilet's just barely flush. Oh, you mean literally, okay. Watch out, the next street is overrun with drug dealers. Yo, where's the the John? Where's this music again? Really lovely. Hey, isn't that straight flame? Be glad you don't have the eye. This place just goes on and on. I don't go home anymore. Is this straight flame as a janitor? With eye vision? Oh, is back rooms reference? Yeah, I guess you would need eye to get stuck in the back room, right? Seems like it makes sense to me. 
How, how are we doing on the... Was that the... Uh, the last artifact? Yes, it was. There's the crapper. They sure looked overflown. Looks like... Well... What is this poster? Look at all these graphics just in general. What's going on? Looks like there are some interesting books in here. Aliens really visited the Sodium Sea by Reynold Perez. The 500 most interesting tattoos by Camille Borogian. Plumber's Raft, the 1995 San Diego tank rampage by Nelson Yamagichi. Are these like book recommendations? They might just be book recommendations. Straight up, hello toast. I do have hollow. Love this elevator music. I think I've been. I think I heard it in a different level too. Oh. Uh, on the. Uh, what does this symbolize? Guess that's it. Got an artifact. Was it in here? Yeah. And then this loops around. Was there any additional doors here? I guess that's it. I don't understand this though. <laughs> it's over my head. Nice way to. Like the middle ninja, this is just me thinking of randomizer stuff, but like he's not actually climbing onto anything solid, but because of the great gra graphics are placed, it makes sense. Can't replicate that though. My house is worth less than when I bought it. Feels bad, man. Welcome to El Centro. <laughs> what is this? Can I be a hacker again? I'm just gonna be not going inside. No? <laughs> what is this? It's so weird. Okay. It's sea level. Miss Coconut's Palm Tree Farm. Okay. Looks looking better. Goggles do nothing. See? Moon. O Ocotillo in. Ocotillo? Ocotillo? Octolings? Hello, I would like a room. Welcome, your room is upstairs to the far end of the hall. You're going to Nugent Empire's wedding too? You're smart. Oh yeah, we're going to a wedding. Man, it's been a while. This place was a third of the price of staying at the venue. Score! It looks like a good enough place to me. Nice green bed. I like that. Could use the lavatory though, but whatever. Uh, sleep? Wait, what? I didn't sleep. No. No. Let's take a nap. Mm. <laughs> okay. Cute. Uh, there's a lot of cute little details like that in this level. That's like so much effort for such a little, just a moment, fleeting moment thing. But that's really charming. Thanks for staying with us. Nothing like a free continental breakfast. Oof. All right. All freshly rested. Let's do this. 
Found all some artifacts. The clothing store is open now. Oh, our secret reward thing. We can come to the wedding not looking like clowns. Let's wear white. Welcome to Agave Outfitters. There's a pretty yellow dress over there that would look great on you. Am I not wearing a yellow dress though? It looks like a sail. Oh! <laughs> so cute with the hair up and the little... Looks like a tutu. That's cute. Thanks for shopping with us. Have fun at the wedding. Now I'm going to a welding. Oh, and a golden umbrella. Looks cool, but lost its shield powers, but at least that's worth it. I gotta look at the part. Welcome to the Giltmore Hotel. Oh, look at me going inside. All these little details. Um, what is this, like a gate? Not the actual hotel? Wow, this place is fancy! <laughs> I love that. <laughs> little flamingo. I spent nine months out of the year fishing on an Alaskan cod boat. Feels good to take a load off. Fishing life is one of solitude. You really get to know yourself and the nature around you. Do you get to na know the nature? I feel like you were stuck on a boat. Oh. Plastic tube. Or metal tube. But I guess you would you definitely become one with <laughs> you become one with the ocean, I suppose. John P. Wealthy Golf Course. And I saw somewhere, <laughs> someone like raging about the percentage of the U.S. being used for golf courses. Like, it's un unacceptable. And it's like 70% unused space. I like the GCs, but you gotta just, you gotta really notice it the first time around. How do you even make something animate over such a large area? I have no idea. He way overshoots it. Four bonk. May I play? Actually, caddies are a modern representation of slavery. Do we go inside and listen to this dumbass ceremony? I don't even like those two. I hate weddings. Let's get blackout drunk at the reception. What if I hate alcohol too? Oh, there's the happy couple. Look at me, I look better. April 12th, dear Uni, it was so amazing to have you at our wedding. You are an amazing dancer. Eugen's parents got a kick out of it. Okay. Uh, the robot vacuum was a weird gift. Toxin Hylar. Sounds like a great gift. Don't like vacuum. Alright. Really big image files generally. Huh? Dian, thank you for playing. This level is dedicated to Plana. Okay, so maybe sh she knows better what this was all about, because I'm kind of confused. These are the places in this level in IRL, California, and Arizona. Junin, Calico, Sagari, Oasis, Camelberry, Lake Morena, Anza, Borrego Desert, Borrego Springs, Glamis Dunes, Golden Acre, and Casino del Sedona, Crystal Magic. Like stuff, Sunny Jim's Cave, Salton Sea, Salvation Mountain, South Central, In and Burger, any of them. Hillsmore Hotel. So maybe. Yes, you will, Skyfish. Maybe this made more sense if you've like been to any of those places. It's, oh, it looks just like you. Yeah, that's so cool. Credits, level cuts and stuff, and some graphics by Lucinda. Assets by Alan Schmidt, the Static Casino. Lit knob for turbines, that was cool. Playable characters, also cool. Full floaty, very cool. Cold booth, don't remember. Golf accessories, cool. Beach accessories, nice. Trouché. 
Eight tiles? Not sure. Dead fish. Uh -huh. She made a lit now to dead fish. Not nice. Robin, aka Pie for the golfers. Skater. The slot machines. Wide shifts. Wait, those were wide shifts? Not just a row of shifts somehow? Interesting. Oh yeah, Pie made all the cool animated graphics. Like the slot machines. Plural for distress creepy edits. Water tower. Lana for in and out plants, white plants and grapes. White plants and grapes. And shrieks for Palazzo Derrico Recolo. I come by Mino, testing by Straight Flame and Glen Long Long Music was Lucinda, Teke to Divide. wonder which one that was. Seems like mostly not Lucinda music, actually. Glenn Rice and his Beverly Hillbillies eat along little doggies. Talk to Turtle, are you there, invisible woman? Anything times Deborah, an actual snow building's phantom twin. Brian Maithi is daydreaming of itself. More Rusk, 100 BPM. Alan Nickel is Ultimate Warshaw, as affixed by Sophie's Nerd and Jitta's. Russian Sodaris, okay. Dude from my Discord. Crowander, Seek and Hide, the Danger Girl Starship, Miscarriage. Giacomo Forte, the Noi. GH Keys 16, Emily Lacey Sweetheart, Dialing in Times, Good Morning Irene, and Lucinda Shadow of a Thought. So two of us in the I think we're about halfway to the front porch. Is someone talking? Is <laughs> that a tab open or is that in the music? Tassets. <laughs> Why doesn't take Anderson Brothers and in the Bloodsmaster, Community Tassa Project, Drakan, Eagle Master, Emerald Fire 7, Farik, Fubaka, G Boots, Head Grinder, I'm Azul, Janus, Home Traveler, Off 99, Omni, Pip, Polana, Pumpkin Bot, Purple Link, Salmon Hale, thank you, Elder, Christian Schnellen, Alex Silva, Sanashi, Taubes, Tiger and V, Unknown Person, Vegetable Giver, Louis Woke, Warner, Cast of Characters. Cool font is Carnival Freak Show by Christopher Hansen. Where do you even that many? Different tacits. It's <laughs> a lot of people making tacits. Until next time. All right, that was a pretty cool level. Let's see how big is this level if we don't do any reading, huh? What if we just go? I'm curious. Definitely starting to feel that Lucinda has a very distinct style. Um, but that style is not the Shalev style. You know what I mean? I cannot complain about a level like this. Because it's very polished. Like it's such a solid, presented, professional looking thing. It's just not what I would do with chaos or what I want out of chaos. But it's so beautiful. <laughs> There's just enough gameplay for me not to be able to complain about that. quite crazy how beautiful it is how many like really nice screens you just run past or you can just run past this was never explained this is just this is just something that happened this way we'll get to see the non dressed up ending as well which i assume is different because if here's the fall there's like little things happening on the sides as you fall as well, which you barely can see. But yeah, I think the ending had a thing where it showed that I had all the artifacts. So I think there will be a separate ending. Do I need to go inside?
Whoa, that was unbelievable. Oh, was that the toll booth thing? <laughs> this is hustle stream. I mean, it symbolizes what they were on the border. But what does it even? What am I supposed to take from that? You know, it's fine that I don't understand it. It's not like this level was dedicated to me. Kind of awkward if it was, and I'm like not understanding anything. It's dedicated to Palana, so hopefully she enjoyed. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is so weird. Because my double jump somehow is a lot less powerful than I'm just letting the gust to take me out. And I guess we need all the coins, we need to do the hacking minigame, because I need to have 10 to get past the scanner. Okay, this is probably the best part of the this little desert sequence into the casino sequence. Money, why not gamble over there? of geese and then 50 screens of uh, GC. Can't you do coins as like some sort of triggers for warps and stuff? No, you could do a lot of these. Once you exit here, I guess you could always hack again, right? Like if you exit without getting all the coins. I did not set the animation last time. Cute. Glitch corn jump jump was pretty nuts. I'm surprised to see Lucinda design something like that. That's more of a glip roll sort of thing. And I don't quite understand that message. That she made this hard jump and then that inspired her to make the rest of the level. Like, the rest of the level is quite different from that screen. <laughs> she, like, she wanted to get that screen out and she had to design a level around it somehow. You know. 
it's good that you can make chaos levels to like make statements or whatever. It's cool to see that side of it. It's cool to see the realistic stuff and the real world stuff, whatnot. But I am allowed to have personal tastes and opinions. Just to avoid a revision of the first thing that was put as an Easter egg. Am I bad at reading chat? I'm not sure if you wrote that a long time ago. What? These wide shifts, that's cool, man. I wonder if that can be. Seems like it would be useful for something. safe by this little slope but shop is closed today. You missed all seven artifacts. Wait, do you know how many I missed? Or do you mean that I missed some of the seven? <laughs> is there a different one for each number of artifacts you have? Let's play the level six more times. I'm going to give my hotel. Okay, let's see. Comments about my outfit. Those for the artifacts, but it's the same. But anyway, amazing new rule. Alright, looks like it was the same anyway. I just was able to. <laughs> there it is. There is different dialogue for each number of artifacts. Nice. Artifact flag examples with this one. That's crazy. What? I'm curious, but I'm not gonna replay it a million times to see. How can we see that? That's funny. I mean, it's a really cool level. I guess the, the main reason I'm annoyed, sort of, I mean, annoyed isn't really fair to say, but sort of annoyed by this level is because I know how much like effort was put to it and imagine that effort put into something that I like because my taste is what's important um, let's see I'm close world wise I'm close that's where you enter that 
That's the pool. Where's the clothes shop? The clothes shop should be before the pool. Man, there's some warp shenanigans going on here. That's the clothes. Oh, okay. Okay, found it, found it, found it, found it. Uh, you guys can't see it. Yes, you can. Oh, well, there you go. So now, how do I read the sign? Let <laughs> uh, me open this. Okay, you missed. Oh, there's my name. Uh, this you missed all seven artifacts. You missed six out of seven artifacts. Okay, okay. So it's just a counter. You found all but one artifact. That's such a needless amount of effort put into that. There's the sign panel on the bottom right. Wow, there's so much stuff you can do. <laughs> right, that's not what we're here for. Yeah, cool level. For what it was, it was really solid. And maybe it's fun to make sort of a representation of the world around you in chaos. Not my favorite level, but it was quite lovely nonetheless. And boy, do they look good, these Lucinda levels. One thing that's for certain, they'd sure look great. <laughs>